back YouTube, it's your girl Magda Civil. If you've just stumbled across my channel, welcome. This channel focuses on health and fitness. So if you're interested in learning about new recipes or learning about how to structure an exercise regimen, please make sure that you like and subscribe to the channel. As you can see currently, I am 21 weeks pregnant and yes, I am active in the gym. So this exercise or this vlog rather is gonna be based on which cardio equipment I prefer and currently I'm um, performing an incline routine on a treadmill I like to perform a lot of different tricks on the treadmill simply because I get bored very quickly so side squats I'm performing 10 reps of side squats then I go forward back side to side and I continue that rotation for about three or four reps then I just walk straight on incline uh, one thing I noticed that people often do is hold on to the treadmill. Please stop holding on to the treadmill. The whole purpose of the treadmill is to make sure that you are preparing yourself when you're outside, actually. So if you're raising the incline and you find that you're holding on to the treadmill, either decrease the incline or decrease your speed. You're going too fast. There should It, it shouldn't be any reason while you're holding on to the treadmill, you're forcing your body to have a humpback, a humpback posture, and you're also weakening your core. So please be mindful of that. And now currently I'm on the Stairmaster. The reason why I love the Stairmaster, because I'm able to get a quick, I'm able to raise my heart rate a lot quicker. This is very challenging, more challenging than the treadmill. And the reason why I prefer this is because I don't have to waste time trying to warm up. All I got to do is just stay on a Stairmaster. There's nowhere, there's absolutely no place for me to go. I can't hop off to the side or off to the rails. And this, the Stairmaster is more realistic. So what I like to do, I like to do a different, a lot of different variations. I like to skip a step. I like to um, perform a stairmaster routine in intervals. So say for instance, if I'm doing a 45 minute um, exercise routine on the stairmaster, I'll just do 10 minutes at a time, and that makes it a lot easier for me to mentally complete the routine. If I'll increase the level or decrease the level depending on which set I'm on for the stairmaster. For the elliptical, I love to challenge myself this way by increasing the resistance on the elliptical machine and also going down to that squat position. That also targets the glutes when you're on the elliptical. See, this is um, also including your muscles. So it's, this is a form of interval training. So it's important to just switch up the routine and not stick to just one machine specifically and always stretch after your workout. I love to stretch out my hips, opening up my hips because we live in a sedentary lifestyle and now our lifestyle is more sedentary than ever. Everything is more convenient. We're a lot more lazy compared to our ancestors. So therefore it's important to open up those hips because we're sitting for longer periods of time. Stretching out those hips. This is um, the pigeon pose that I love to perform. Often people ask me, Magda, how are you able to just become so flexible, especially, you know, being pregnant? <laughs> One thing for sure is all about practice when it comes to stretching. Just do it a bit at a time, a day at a time, and you'll be fine. Thank you guys again. Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure that you engage on the channel. It's so important for you to engage. I thank you so much. I'm Magda Civil. Please make sure that you stay active and stay blessed. See you next time.